So what is I? The pitiful meow monster. <laughs> no, for real. This video is gonna be pretty good. So nerf rival balls. Balls. This is a nerf ball compared to a headshot ball. So headshot ammo, most of them have no inconsistencies, but I'll just grab a random headshot out of the bin and see what I get here. That's not one, that's... Okay, this is a random headshot. This is a nerf rival round, close up. This is nerf. See? That's what your nerf ball is looking like. Barely no inconsistencies. Now this is headshot. There's small inconsistencies that might, they're like this, but there's not much that I can really complain about. I did find one or two that are terrible. I found one that's really terrible. I'll try to find it real quick. Oh God, there's mosquitoes downstairs in the house. So uh, I'm trying to find this uh, round. Oh, this is also another nerf round, just for that. This is also nerf. It has no inconsistencies. Now I got I got 110 headshot rounds in total because I got a whole bunch of headshot rounds. Now these are just some rounds. Now these are probably nerf and headshot. Let's see if there's any are nerf. That one's nerf. That one's nerf. That one's headshot. That one these are headshot. And that one's nerf. So we got three nerfs and two headshots. This is the headshot. Extremely slight to no inconsistencies. And I know I have to clip my fingernails. I'll get to that later. And this is another headshot. There's a small inconsistency right there. But not much. And then these are the nerf. There's basically nothing on this one. Nothing on that one and slight maybe just in the slightest on this one so the nerf ones definitely have less inconsistency than headshot and some headshots are not good of overall headshot i'll give you a five a four and a half star rating because headshot's really good it's really good for cheap balls i would give it a five star rating and i forget i'll just give it a five star rating i don't want to shame hasbro too much because i know they have to make i know that they have to make their profit too but definitely headshot ammo is awesome. And if you're if you're a real and if you're running out of rival balls, please just buy headshot. It's it's amazing. It's really awesome how cheap it is compared to rounds, rival rounds that are genuine. I'm trying to find this one that has a serious inconsistency. Just to show you what you might get. Because there's only one in the entire bin that's like this. It has a uh huge inconsistency definitely not a complaint really it just some of them of course are going to turn out like this i'm sure some nerf rounds turn out like this so it's not really a bad thing hold on i found this weird dart in my bin look at this thing this is so weird let me see if it shoots yeah it hits just as hard okay so um oh geez where is that headshot I know I didn't throw it away because I like to keep anything damaged in ammo because I am really cheap with my ammo and if somebody steals a single rival round from me then I'm going to go absolutely Hong Kong Godzilla mode. Okay, that's not even an exaggeration. I wish I could say that was a serious exaggeration but it's really not. Okay, I'm trying to find these headshot, this headshot ball. I know I didn't throw it away. I keep, I... Ooh! Oh, I thought that was a... What is that? Oh, that's not... Okay. Hmm. Okay, so, um... Wherever this headshot... I, I always have to prove my point. I can't go without proving my point. Where is the headshot ball? There's demolisher rockets. Those are definitely not even close to headshot damage headshot balls. Can't <laughs> damage balls. Oh jeez. 
Oh, and also something I just noticed, I didn't notice this before, but inconsistencies come off of the headshot rounds, I guess. So maybe you can just wipe your inconsistencies right off. That's what it's looking like. Because you can see here, that's an inconsist- that's- those are all inconsistencies from these headshot rounds. I guess you can just wipe the inconsistencies right off, unless it's like a- a manufacturing inconsistency. If it's like too much mold, it seems like you can just wipe it right off. So that's even better rating for headshot. I don't know if the company's actually called Headshot. I really doubt that. Headshot Enterprises. I doubt it's called Headshot as a company. I'm guessing just the ammo's called Headshot. See, this one has a whole lot of inconsistencies. This is not the one I was looking for, but this is one of them. This one has a whole lot of inconsistency, but if I'm right, I should... Yes, see, look. I can just rip this inconsistency right off, and then my Headshot round is looking perfect. You just wipe it right off. You can basically, if you have enough fingernails, which I probably won't in five minutes, but if you have enough fingernails, you can just scrape these inconsistencies right off the headshot rounds because they're just extra mold on the sides, which are which is soft. But the whole he the headshot rounds are pretty durable, though. I haven't studied these much in real life, on only online, but my overall rating right now is pretty high. You almost feel like they have a higher, like, they feel different than Rival Rounds. I can't say better or worse, but they, I like the texture of them. Rival Rounds are a little lighter, I mean, a little lighter, it feels like. Look at that, that thing used to have a whole bunch of inconsistencies, and now it's almost perfect. This is what I'm saying. These headshot rounds, the inconsistencies can be fixed if they're to a certain level of not bad. Now... I will find, oh, this is my suction, this is a suction cup dart, I haven't found one of these in a while. Um, I don't have any of the Busby darts, I lost my, all of them. Busby darts are awesome. Because they stick to things. Keep making sticky Busby darts, Busby. I know no one in Busby is probably watching this, but hey, I'm going to attempt it. Sticky darts are awesome, because you can... Ah, if people were made out of glass, which would be so weird, but then you could prove your point of call of call your hits, buddy, because the dart would just be stuck to them. I know it sticks to glass, the button. I, what in the world? Do you see that? Okay, yeah, see, darts are in these demolisher rockets sometimes. Oh, jeez. If I can find this headshot around, I should just dump out my old bin and look for it. And then I would find it probably by now, like 20 minutes ago. I know this is a long, crappy video. My videos are crap. I have to admit myself. But my videos never were good, even on my old YouTube channel. But I guess some people thought they were okay. I guess, thank you for getting 200 and something views in a day. Like, yesterday, that was awesome. I don't know. I didn't even know that until my friend told me. I don't check my stats much. Because, honestly, I just check them every once in a while. And I would have seen that much later. See, I'm getting these inconsistencies rubbing off on my hands. Which I love. Because you can rub these inconsistencies right off. And <coughs> get, the <coughs> get, the <coughs> get these things back to shape. Now, I'm just going to dump my bin out, because honestly, that seems like, it's more like an Apple Store bag. And then find this headshot round. Now, I can see there's a heck ton of everything in here, even these, a few of these. Only, that's, I only have two of these dart zones. Dart zone, ball zone. <laughs> Okay, where is that headshot round there I was looking for? Okay. And where did that headshot round go? Hmm, jeez, I can't find the headshot round. I need to prove my freaking point. Oh my god. Where's this headshot round? Unless the inconsistency fix, it's fixed itself, which it can't do because it's, not, it's an inconsistency with how the thing was manufactured. 
<laughs> like the design, but you know what I mean. This element, by the way, is modified, and I might make a video on it in the future. If you want me to make a video on it in the future, just tell me, because I'm more than happy to, because this thing hits like an absolute truck. You probably couldn't see that, because I'm not showing where it's going. But, uh, yeah, I'll probably make a video if you want me to make a video on it. I'm not going to make a video if nobody says make a video, because I'm not, I don't really want to make a video on the mod, because I have to deal with everything again, but I'll do it. Um, I hate making videos on my mods, because I always have something to fix, something that's not good, something that has to get better. Now, where is that headshot man? I probably passed by it 70 times, because I looked at the other side. That chat round will be found. Oh my god. Balls. Oh jeez. This thing just completely. Has a lot of balls in it. I can find this damaged ball. I think it could just be damage actually. Okay, so I'm gonna start scouting for it and I'm gonna stop putting my hand in here, maybe, because that might actually work. Where is the mic? Is that it? Yes, that's it. This is the one with the serious inconsistency. Now, not much can be seen, but you can see this part's super squishy for some reason. It's like an air pocket in there. So, yeah, that's the headshot round. So, that is about it. I probably stick this in the uh, element here and see if I can shoot a rival round out of an elite dart pistol and if I shove this on in here really good then it might actually work that just sounded wrong but I know what I'm talking about okay so that's a rival round in an element if this thing actually works I am gonna I'm this is blowing my mind if this works yeah the ball just won't come out yeah, so definitely not. But, yeah, guys, that's about it for the video. Uh, I just lost my headshot. Okay, this is my headshot ball. Serious thing in the cities. I'm not going to worry about it. So, peace out, guys. I guess I'm going to end this super long video. And tomorrow's Friday the 13th, so super good luck for everybody. Because that's the best day of good luck. Now, let me just scoop these things on up. That didn't help at all. That... And put, put, put. Demolish your missiles. I know they're not even called Demolisher Missiles, they're technically called Elite Missiles, but I'm going to call them Demolisher Missiles, even though I don't even have a Demolisher. I don't want a Demolisher, I'm not going to, I'm probably not even going to get one if I see it in the thrift store. I might, if I see one. But the Demolisher is not that good of a blaster, in my opinion. I'll grab it, you know, if I see it in a thrift store, I'll grab it. Everything there is so cheap. So, um, I'm about to end this video because I need to clean up my mess. I just made a mess. I have so many darts and so many balls. <laughs> I'm trying to keep this headshot out because I'm going to show a little bit more of it before I end this video. I know it's so much easier to just scoop these things up here with the bag, but I'm an old-fashioned type guy. Okay, so there's a whole lot of balls. It's mostly just balls and darts on the edges. Okay. Yeah, I, I cannot even, I probably didn't even lose a single headshot round yet, because I can't lose them. Honestly, I have problems with that. If I lose a single headshot round, or a single round, rival round, I'll just call it rival round, because they fit in rival blasters. If I lose a single one, I get angry, like really angry. I don't really count how many I have, and I'm sure if I did, then I would be the most angry person on the entire face of the earth. Knowing how many I lost. But dude, I have hard times losing rival rounds. You never find rival rounds in the parking lot. Because I don't even I don't even bring them outside. Really. Unless I'm just testing the range. Because I'm scared of losing rival rounds. Let me try shooting an element with a rival round one more time.
Sorry, guys. Yeah, you can't really shoot this. But peace, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video.